Hey guys, this is Jessica and welcome back to my channel. So I got so many compliments on my makeup the other day and so many people were like, please do a makeup tutorial. So that is what I did for you today. Um, it's just a really beautiful, romantic, mauve kind of look, I guess, with a really beautiful lip, nude lip. And uh, yeah, so I really do like this look. This is usually my everyday go-to look. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. And of course, if you have not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button. It's free, it doesn't cost you anything. And don't forget to click the bell right next to it so you get notified of whenever I post new videos. And if you hadn't added me on Snapchat, go right ahead and add me on Snapchat and see what kind of fun I'm having. So let's get into this tutorial, guys. So first we are going to prime our face with the NYX Angel Veil Primer. This has been my go-to primer uh, ever since I got it. And I really like how it mattifies my face and how my foundation looks with it. Um, our foundation we are using today is the Tarte Amazonian Clay Foundation. I am in the color Light Neutral, and I'm, I am using a flat top kabuki brush from It Cosmetics to apply my foundation. This is my favorite foundation in the world, if you can't tell. <laughs> Then I'm going to put some concealer under my eyes using the Tarte Shape Tape in light. And then I'm taking a dry uh, sponge and I am just dabbing it out. And yeah, I like to use a dry sponge. You know, some people use wet. Then we're going to take our air spun powder in translucent. And we are just going to bake under our eyes. You don't have to do this step, but I just find it works good with my oily face. <laughs> then I'm going to take some of my Kat Von D press powder and I'm going to put it all over my face with another it, uh, it Cosmetics brush. Then for my brows, I am using the It Cosmetics um, Brow Power in the color Taupe. And some days I have good days with my brows. Other days, I don't have so good days, but uh, yeah. So I'm just filling those in, starting with the tail, and then just filling them in and trying to get them as close to similar as possible. <laughs> then I'm just going to take a fluffy brush and brush off my bake, because it's been sitting there for about 10 minutes. So now we're going to contour. I'm using the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil in the color Medium Deep. So I'm just going to start with contouring my nose. Now everyone contours their nose differently. You do it however you like to. Then I'm going to just follow my hairline and, you know, just brush it out, you know. <laughs> and then I'm just going to do a little bit of my cheeks, keeping it up on the higher part of my cheek. I don't like to bring my contour down a lot. Then I'm going to take a Real Techniques setting brush and I'm just going to blend out that nose contour. So for blush, I'm using Makeup Geek, and this is in the color Puppy Love. So, and I'm again, I'm just concentrating that blush on the outer, on the higher part on my cheek. So this is our color scheme for our eyes today. So this first color, I believe, is called Made to Last, and I'm just taking a fluffy brush, and I am just going over my eye with it and just blending it out all over my eyelid. Then the next color I'm going to get with my Morphe crease brush is the color Top Notch. It's a beautiful brick terracotta color. I don't know what was up with my brush, but it was not applying it the way that it usually does. So, um, but yeah, but I just concentrate this on my outer V and just bringing it up into my crease. Then I'm going to take my fluffy brush again and I'm just going to blend out and make everything go together. Then the last color it is called Popular Demand and I'm just going to concentrate it mostly on that outer V 
And this brush, I believe, is a e.l.f. brush. It only cost me a dollar. And I think it's their blending brush, but I like it because it's small and it does really good detail work for that outer crease. Then I'm taking that fluffy brush again, and we are just blending. This is a very blending process. Now I'm going to go in with my Lime Crime palette, and I'm taking this color Aura, and I am just putting it on the inner corner of my eye and just highlighting that because that opens up your eyes. I don't really need it because my eyes are pretty open, you know. Then for my liquid eyeliner on the top eye, this is from NYX and it is their matte uh, black one. It's my favorite liquid eyeliner. Like, I've tried other ones and I always come back to this one. <laughs> Now I'm just going to coat my lashes with some L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara in black. And my waterline, I'm using just a plain coal eyeliner. You can use whatever you like. So for our highlight, we are using ColourPop Lunch Money. It is my favorite highlight. It is one of their best sellers. Definitely get it if you have light or fair skin. Then I'm using NYX uh, Matte Setting Spray. And now we're doing lashes. So the lashes I'm using are the Ardell Faux Mink Lashes in number 810. And yeah, I love these lashes. They are my go-to. They are my favorite. <laughs> if you want a lash tutorial, I will have it linked somewhere in this box. So then I'm going back in and I'm taking Top Notch and Popular Demand and I'm just putting it under my bottom lash line and smoking it out. That's what I like to do. I like a good grungy kind of eye smoked out. You don't have to do this if you don't like it or you don't have to do it as crazy as I do it to each their own. For lips, I'm using the Kat Von D Lolita lip pencil which I love so I'm just outlining my lips and then I'm just going to fill in the outer corners of my top and bottom lip along with a little bit right in the middle of my bottom lip then I'm going to just top it with some lip gloss this is ColourPop lip gloss in the color fairy floss I love it. It just make it just brings this look all together. It's so freaking beautiful. So thank you for watching my tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you like this video, definitely give me a thumbs up or leave a comment down below. And again, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And yeah, I'll see you on the next one, guys. <laughs>